Hey guys, Nick here from Click and Droid, and today I'm going to show you two things that you can do to your Click ROM. So the first thing I'm going to show you is going to be how to add live wallpapers to your ROM, and the second thing I'm going to do is going to show you how to de-blur a Click ROM. Now, this will work with any Click ROM or Dext ROM. Um, it would, I guess it would work on a Claire to Click, but I don't see why you'd want to use it on a Claire to Click, because that already has all the live wallpapers in stock. Um, click so if you want just stock and live wallpapers flashy clear click and don't follow this tutorial so let's get into it first of all I'm going to have a link in the description to both files the first one I'm going to show you do is how to get live wallpapers so go to that link and download it and put it on your SD card and um, boot into recovery so let's boot into recovery here Alright, so once you're in recovery, you're going to want to go to choose zip to install and press the home button. Um, your recovery image might not look like this, it might look a little different depending on which one you flashed when you rooted. So just keep that in mind. And then you want to look for LW patch and flash that. So press the home button and home again to flash it. And it shouldn't take that long. There we go, it's done. And once it's installed, you want to reboot your device. So while it's rebooting, I just want to take the time to say that I'm not sure if this will work on the Click XT or the Backflip. Um, I don't know much about those phones, so don't ask me about that. I'm sorry. And so the second thing I want to say is that you can install live wallpapers from the market with this. So you're not limited to just the one live wallpaper it comes with. You can install Starfield or whatever ones you want to install from the market. So just go into the theme section of the market and you can browse all of them. Oh, and this will only work on 2.1. Just, that's a major point right there. Alright, so now that's loaded up, let's apply the live wallpaper. So to apply it, you just hold down on the home screen on an empty space, and then you go into wallpapers, live wallpapers, uh, loading up still there, and you can select between the maps or the Nexus revamp, which is the two that it comes with. So I'll apply the Nexus revamp here. force close yeah alright so I finally got it applied after a bunch of force closes I expect some problems to happen with this because this isn't made to run on the click so if you encounter a few errors try again uh, over here I have my Nexus and I'm going to show you a comparison to how it runs compared to the Nexus and the click I'm running the same live wallpaper here um, the scrolling is smoother obviously on the Nexus scrolling on the click is kinda really slow as you see there it lags a lot it's frame by frame almost. Um, when you tap down the home screen and you get the little extra Nexus things, this click will slow down a little frame by frame as you see over there. And the Nexus can handle it, I guess. Like, obviously. Um, so if you're going to flash this, I wouldn't recommend using it as a daily wallpaper because you're just going to slow your click down a whole lot. And if you use your click daily, you're not going to want to be running something like this because it's going to be hell trying to use your phone. So like I said, you can install live wallpapers from the market. So I will show you that right now. Let's go into the market here. Go to themes. And we will install... I don't know. What to... Hmm. Let's install... I'm looking for... Let's do that one. So install it. So there we go, now it's installed and we want to go home and we're going to go back to the live wallpaper chooser. Live wallpapers. And then go to the one we installed and set it. And there you go, we've applied one from the market. So you can do that with uh, about any one from the market or anyone you've side loaded through ADB or mounted your SD. So enjoy that, and now I'm going to show you how you can deblur a click ROM. So now I'm going to show you how to deblur your click. Um, this is going to not only deblur, but it's also going to add live wallpaper. So you get two in one. So there's going to be a link in the description to where you can download the zip. And before you start this, you want to make sure you have ADB installed. So I'll have an annotation in the video somewhere that will um, have a link to my video on how to install ADB, or you can find a text tutorial online if you want and follow that. So once you have ADB installed, I'll unzip it on your desktop and open up the folder. 
and go in here make sure your phone is plugged in via USB cable and don't mount the SD card just click charge only so then you want to scroll down in here and click run this to debug your phone and it's gonna run all this stuff here removing all the stuff from your phone it takes a minute alright so there you go it's now finished and it's gonna automatically reboot your phone so give it a second and your phone will reboot and I'm gonna go over the camera and I'm gonna show you how it looks it's gonna take a second to boot on the first time but once it boots up it's gonna look exactly like the stock blur but uh, some of the applications from the regular Clarity Click has been installed like the music app. Now I don't have any music to show you but you can see there that it has little music tabs and everything and the SMS app there we go and just basically all of these stock apps and it has removed the blur apps so that's it thanks for watching if you enjoyed this video don't forget to subscribe and follow me on twitter at click android and i will see you guys next time thanks for watching